Hello guys, today we're talking about <laughs> movies out today, hustles, and no one is buying it. I didn't buy it because it's a waste of money. Buying that movie is basically throwing your money down the drain, okay? So what we have at the best of our movies, oh, it's the same movies we had in the last few days. Even Game of Thrones Season 8 is selling way better than Hustlers is, and everybody hated Season 8. So, here we have is Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. And various other movies out. It's a two which is out now. Um, I don't care about the um, it's okay. Uh, you know, Avengers is still selling. Glens is still selling because it's holidays. Angel has phone is still selling. You know, I go to the oh, It's not a blockbuster. Of course, it's not gonna sell. It's not a major blockbuster. Okay, yesterday is still selling better. Rocket Man still selling better. Joker is still selling better. And Joker's not even out yet. Are you telling me that people are going to go watch Hustlers? Are you telling me that people are going to watch it? Well, it's like the Ultimate Collection selling better as well. The Greatest Showman selling better than Hustlers, okay? No one's buying this movie, okay? You know, you guys popped up this movie, said it was one of the best movies of the year. Look at the Golden Globe saying it's one of the most creative movies of the year. They're trying to nominate, you know, <laughs> you know, people for, a, you know, trying to nominate that movie for as many awards as possible. See that no one is buying. It. And people say, oh, it's just because people just don't appreciate acting performances, you know, people just don't appreciate the greatness of Hustlers. Well, Joker's still selling better, okay? Joker's still selling better than Hustlers, okay? Even among new releases, Hustlers is still not even the top 30. Not even the top 30. Hustlers is at 40. It is below Joker 4K, it's below the White House, White House. It's below this movie. Hustlers is just not selling. No one is buying this movie. Okay. You know, we have proven it time and time again that no one buys Hustlers. No one's buying this movie. It's just going to be like Booksmart and Midsummer. No one's going to buy those movies. And Midsummer is actually at 49. No one's going to buy this movie at all. Okay. Same thing when Charlie Angels comes out. You know, same thing when, you know, Doc Fate comes out. Okay, same thing have all these other garbage movies come out that you guys kept trying to pop up and say how great they are, but no one went out to go see them. Hustle's on 4K is only at 96. It's selling worse than Abominable. Okay, it's selling worse than that movie. Okay, movie, another movie nobody wanted to see because it was, because it was another yet another Yeti movie. Okay, you know you guys just don't on these these critics just do not understand that no one wants to watch. The movies that they prop up and say how great and masterpieces they are, and you know they just don't sell. Okay, you know you don't see Booksmart. Actually, Booksmart is not as was able to get. They they also took out John Wick and Aladdin to do like the last three months of the movies. So they took off uh, you know those movies. But if we get you know comedies, for example, Booksmart is not one of the best selling comedies. Okay. Booksmart is not among the best-selling comedy, okay? <laughs> I don't, you know, Booksmart is just not selling. Okay, not even, oh, I think that's new releases. Best-selling movies in comedy. Booksmart's not even among the best-selling movies at all. Not even the top 50. Probably not in the top 100. To be honest, no one's buying Booksmart, okay? You guys said how much of a masterpiece Booksmart was, okay? That, oh my god, Booksmart's a masterpiece of comedy. No one's buying it. No one is buying Booksmart, okay? Nobody is buying it. Literally nobody, okay? You know, you guys said how much of a masterpiece Booksmart was, but it's just not selling. You know, it's just not selling. No one is buying it. No one is buying Booksmart. Same thing with action movies, okay, we've got action movies, no one's buying Ben Back to National, and no one's buying Dark Phoenix, okay? You know, it's gonna be, that's like, Turn of Dark Fate, that's what's gonna do similar to Man Back to National, okay? Man Back to National actually up to 78. Dark Phoenix actually up to 76, but <laughs> they're still not in the top 50, okay? No one's buying these movies, okay? You know, <laughs> Man Back to National is being outsold by Guardians of the Galaxy, a five year old movie already, okay? Being outsold by John Wick on 4K, another five-year-old movie, okay? 
You have five-year-old movies easily outselling these movies that you guys pop up and say how much of a masterpiece they are. And guess what? They just do not sell. They just do not make money. Okay? Man Back to Nasto was already a flop to begin with. And, you know, x Men and Dark Phoenix was already a flop to begin with. Same thing with Dark Fate, okay? You know, same thing with... Oh, no, Ugly Doors does not count. That, that's an action movie, really? You're telling me that's an action movie. Okay? Ugly Dolls, according to you guys, is an action movie. Okay? Are we about Angel Saturday? Only at 90. Uh, it seems that people... But Only About Angel is sold out, so any movie that gets sold out gets continues going down in the charts. Because Only About Angel is actually sold out, so that's probably why it went down. Because usually when movies sell out, they, don't, or they go down the charts because you can't, because you don't only buy third party sellers. But <laughs> Back to Nationals is selling awful, okay? Doc Phoenix is also sold out, has been sold out like that since Black Friday. There's really no one's buying this movie, okay? No one can buy this movie after Black Friday is over, okay? You know, no one's gonna buy. It's still the worst selling X Men movie, even if it, if it, if, it, if it, even if it didn't make money, it will still been the worst selling X Men movie. Okay, it's still the worst selling X Men movie on Blu Ray. Okay, you know, worst selling X Men movie on Blu Ray. No one's buying it. Okay. Once upon a time, Hollywood is always sold out on Blu Ray 4K. Okay, Hustlers will never sell out because it's just sit there on shelves in every store and just not sell. Okay, just not sell at all. Okay, and that's basically it. Goodbye.